Hey guys, Sir Shuevi bringing you another episode, and in this episode we're going to continue where we left off in the last episode. Uh, except, we're not in the same location just because I wanted to get closer to the mission start, just to make things a lot easier for us. Anyways, this time we're going to start the next mission, which is... Uh, don't worry, I won't, I won't touch the, the paint. <laughs> yep, don't you worry, I'm not going to wear paint, touch the wall. I don't know. Anyways, um, yeah, we're going to continue this mission, and we're going to start this mission, rather. Uh, sure. I'm always happy to help out. Gives me XP, gives me caps. Hopefully, I'll be able to get, like, another level up or something out of this. Probably not. But, uh, you know, just 100 caps. Oh, that sounds decent-ish. Sure, head. Whatever. I'm just gonna say yes because I have Piper with me and she's she's not really she doesn't like when I barter for for higher by the way can I actually do like a, a right. challenge or something with her like not, just you know talking to her uh I suppose so hey I'm not one to judge honestly it's just nice to not be doing it alone for a change in my line of work things tend to get pretty hairy okay been shot at poisoned nearly executed holy crap heck until recently they called the lock up in diamond city the piper suite that's pretty hilarious story, I suppose. that's good that you're a dedicated reporter you know you do what you want Someone poisoned, poisoned you? Are you kidding me i barely had the paper going before i got poisoned wow this time i just published an article about this cartel of caravans that have been driving up food prices in the city article went over well even got a boycott of their goods started in town so I figured I'd pop over to the dugout in for a victory. Sure. I'd already taken a swig by the time I realized something was wrong. The Dean, he wasn't at the bar. The beer tasted off, even more so than usual. Yeah, that was pretty bad signs. Real I don't know what That's my said dog once again. I had to get it out. I'm looking around for something, and there it is. The still, and I just start chugging moonshine. <laughs> Honestly, I'm still not totally convinced it was better than just dying from the poison, but it worked. Yeah, you have to get your stomach pumped in order to get everything that done. Passed out on the floor, security managed to grab the bartender. He eventually ratted out his bosses, and they all got to share some time in the pen. Wow. That's pretty crazy. Seems that execution didn't quite take, huh? <laughs> Thank God. I'd been working on this story about irradiated drinking water in Bunker Hill. I traced the water back to its source through these old sewer tunnels. Sure. Do I find the children of Adam setting up like they own the place. Unfortunately, they found me just as quick. Turns out they were not fond of reporters. So, to atone for my trespassing, they decided to make a sacrifice to Adam. Me. Of course, because, you know, crazy cultists tend to do crazy stuff. And suddenly I blurt out, Adam, he reveals himself. That's funny. Buy it. They pulled me back from the ledge and then gave me their induction ceremony. You are looking at an official acolyte. Took me a couple of days before I managed to sneak away, get Bunker Hill security to finally clean the place up. Sounds pretty fun. An exciting life. Sure have. But honestly, now that I'm out here with you, I feel like I'm just getting started. Get in trouble. It's what folks like us do. Yeah, I guess. We're out here putting ourselves at risk so people in the Commonwealth can have a chance at a better life. Exactly. Well, you know, we do the dirty work so that other people don't have to. I mean, I kind of want a reward. I'm just going to be completely honest with you. Wanted to let you know. I'm real happy to be along for the ride. Cool. Let's try flirting. I wouldn't want it any other way. I like having you close. Oh, uh, thanks. <laughs> that, that's awfully sweet. Unexpected of you. So you want to get out of here? Sure. Anyways, let's start, let's actually start off that mission. Uh, what we need to do is we need to go to Hardware Town, if I remember correctly, in order to get the paint for Abbott. And the way that we get the paint for Abbott is by um, mixing the blue and the yellow paint together, you know, two different primary colors, and that makes the green paint. Because blue plus yellow equals green. Which is pretty cool, you know, they kind of teach you how to mix stuff. 
Anyways, let's start that. Let's actually start that mission. Um, yeah, it's it's close enough that we can just walk there. You know, I don't I don't have to actually fast travel to all the locations. More so just because I want to get experiences, uh, rather experience points from uh, you know fighting enemies uh, and stuff like that. You know, I, I don't want to just quickly fast travel back and forth over and over because that way you, you don't honestly get that much experience and you don't really dive into the world of Fallout as well. Like, as much as you should, or you could, I should say, normally, you know, if you were to uh, to actually take the time out and explore it all on your own, you know, on, on your own time, on your own uh, budget or whatever. I don't know, I don't even know what I'm saying anymore. I'm, I'm, I'm just, I'm, I'm going crazy. <laughs> I need to sleep. Anyways, uh, what I'm probably going to end up doing after this episode, I'm just going to take a quick nap. And actually, no, I sh what I should do is I should get these videos rendered out, you know, ready to go on YouTube. And then just schedule them so that they are ready to go on YouTube. And then after that, I can, while they're uploading, of course, I can just go to sleep, you know? Because it, it takes like, uh, I'll say like an hour of video, roughly. So, it'll, by by the time I wake up from my nap, I sh they should probably be either close to being fully uploaded or they should be fully uploaded by then. So, uh, yeah, that's probably that's probably the best thing I can do for now. Uh, can I actually get it up here? Yes, I can. Cool. Let's go to Hardware Town, and if, if I remember correctly, there's gonna be some more raiders here for us, uh, just because, um, even, even though we killed the raiders that were here before, somehow there are more raiders that pop in, that's just kind of a thing that's gonna happen over and over, because you're gonna end up doing a lot of side missions that'll take you to the same locations, but somehow the enemies will always respawn. That's not a bad thing, you know, that, that means that you get more experience. I could be wrong about that, and there, there might not be anyone here. In fact, it doesn't seem like there's actually anyone here. Okay, I I take it back. I, I just messed up. <laughs> I thought for fact, for sure rather, I thought for sure that there would be some uh, some enemies here, and I for, I honestly forgot about this the last time that I was here. I, you could do this like ahead of time. You don't actually have to wait until uh, you know like the night before, not not the night before, until you when you actually start doing the mission in order to do it. You could literally just do this. There you go. Make green paint. Shaking the paint. Make green paint. Shaking the paint. And make some more green paint. Oh, okay. I need some more blue and yellow paint. Excuse me. Anyways. Now that we got our green paint, we can just get the hell out of here. You know, go back home. Or rather, it's still not our home yet because we, we don't actually have a house there. But that's essentially going to be our home for now because it has a marketplace. It has people that we like. It has jobs. It has security from all forces outside, which is the most important thing, honestly. If we were to live in the post-apocalyptic world, the most important thing would probably be uh, food sources, water, as well as security. And I'm pretty sure that that's, like, what the main things that people tend to seek. They always want to go for, like, uh, actually, I don't want to activate that blip yet, so I'm going to go through this area here. Uh, they always want to go for, like, uh, safety and, you know, getting food, water... Uh, friends as well, you know, get their friends with them so that way you don't you're not alone. That's always, that always tends to be like the thing that a lot of people always end up uh, focusing on. Anyways, don't know where that tangent was headed, so let's let's just go into the. Uh, excuse me. I mentioned that I was sleepy. Should I should have just ended up ended it on the last episode. But I just wanted to do like three episodes at this session just because, you know, it'll just give me a little bit more buffer time to make more videos. And speaking of which, I'm probably going to end up making some other videos as well. Uh, more so for like other LP projects. And I'm, I don't know which one I want to do. I kind of want to feel, I feel like doing like a Mario type game. And I could do that. But the only thing is that I don't know like how the copyright works with Nintendo. Because, uh, for, for, whatever, for whatever reason, rather, Nintendo just decided to be kind of douchey to everyone. There you go, see? This is the marriage ceremony between, uh, Miss Sedna and Zwicky. I only wish I had realized that sooner. Then by the power invested in me, I pronounce you man and wife. There's nobody here for the ceremony. It's only us. realized how much she meant to me until she said something. Yep. You're completely welcome for that, man. What's she doing? She's chopping up meat that's not hers. Dude. You're doing extra work, Piper. I mean, I know you're a nice person and all, but like, come on. Whatever. 
Let's, uh, <laughs> let's go turn in this, uh, mission, give him the paint, and, uh, let's collect our reward, you know, get our caps, and as well as the XP. Yes, we did. But I found some. That's damn fine news. I mean, it was simple, honestly. I just walked in, from. made the paint, and got out. I didn't fight anyone. The hardest thing was just probably just running, honestly. Anyways, let's let's uh, use the green. Ooh, I could be a douche and just use blue paint. <laughs> I wouldn't do that. There you go. Working hard. Mm, that's a good shade of green. The wall sure seems happy with it. Yep. Um, I'm happy to help, I guess. Don't know how the wall will be happy, but, uh, sure. There's your payment, and a little bonus for getting the right shade of green. Don't do anything with it I wouldn't do. I'm glad we did this. I don't know what you won't do. Yeah, no problem, Piper. Anyways, let's see. I'm gonna probably end up doing... Nope, not that one. I'm gonna end up doing, uh, the Wanted poster. Just because I never experienced it before, so I don't know if... Oh, man, it's going to suck if that's, that's like a hard enemy or something that I have to hunt down. But it's going to be cool if I'm able to survive it all, you know, because that means that I'm a beast. Not really. It just means that I'm smart, you know, and I just play a lot of FPS games. Uh, anyways, let's go check out this wanted poster over here. Wanted. Bounties here. Feral ghouls in Mass Pike Tunnel. Read. Uh, open notice to anyone with a gun and some ambition. Feral ghoul activity is on the rise near Mass Pike Tunnel. They may not have much in the way of supplies, but they congregate near areas with good salvage. Plus, ridding the world of these monsters will bring a smile to your face. That's kind of weird that they're saying they may not have much in terms of supplies. Think you might be overcompensating there. I'm comp overcompensating with a hunting rifle. Really. Really, dude? You're saying that I'm overcompensating for using a hunting rifle. Like, seriously? Come on, dude. How am I overcompensating if I'm using a hunting rifle? If I were using, like, a freaking, I don't know, like a missile launcher or a junk jet. There you go, a junk jet. If I were using a junk jet or a missile launcher, that's kind of over overcompensating. But using a hunting rifle is not overcompensating in the slightest, dude. You need to check your priorities. Now, I'm not sure what the hell I'm, I'm talking about, anyways. I'm sleepy, I'm tired, I'm so sorry. Oh, anyway. After this mission, I, I'm just gonna knock the hell out. Well, I'm gonna do my best just to render out these videos quickly. The good thing is that, from what I've seen, every single time that I, like, render out videos uh, with this software, it just takes, like, a minute to render out e every video, so... Within 10 minutes, I'll be uploading everything already, and then I could just knock out... <laughs> Yeah, the only thing, though, is I have to worry about my dog actually eating. Hmm. By the way, where where is the, the actual area? Okay, it's pretty close. Yeah, Pike Tunnel's pretty close. So, it's, it's not that bad. I mean, I'm probably going to end up fighting, like, some raiders or something. I'm definitely going to fight some feral ghouls. But I'm probably going to end up fighting, like, some raiders or something along the way. But it's not it's not that bad. Probably it's going to be safer. The safest bet is probably just going to be to follow the road. It's probably going to just end up taking us to the same location anyways. There you go. We can go this way. Let's just start sprinting our asses off. Crouch just to stop the sprint from happening. Or from continuing. Let's activate our vats just in case. Just I'm just looking around to see if there's any enemies here. Uh, one thing that you don't want to do. You don't want to leave a power suit there. Uh, some enemies will spawn here every once in a while, and they actually end up using your your suit if you just leave it lying around. So you don't want to do that. You want you want to play it smart. Don't leave your suit just lying around randomly. Also, it looks like maybe that's a settlement area that I can go to. Yeah, that seriously looks like a settlement. No, what? You know what? No, nope. I'll I'll come back later. When I don't actually have to worry about, uh, nope, I actually do have to go that way. I was about to say, I don't, when I don't have to worry about not getting the bonus XP, but I still have to go this way anyways. Oh, this is Mass Pike Tunnel, that's what it is. Okay, bottle cap, sure. Take the fork. Okay. There you go, screw you, dude. 
I'm just minding my own. I don't want to drink the water. I didn't want to drink the water. I wanted to just collect the reward from killing that guy. Anyways. Let's kill that guy. Just collect the ammo. Thankfully, they have some ammo for us, which is good. It's uh, it's very useful. Also, I saw this guy. He has a toy car. That's not useful to us. And now that I think about it, I did come out of this tunnel like the opposite way. I didn't go into the tunnel this way, but I came out of the tunnel. And uh, this is this was an area that was just completely surrounded by by the raiders. So. I'm wondering, where the hell are the raiders? There you go, scavenger. I guess it wasn't raiders, maybe it was scavengers, I don't know. Nuka-Cola Quantum, didn't want that toy truck, I just wanted the Nuka-Cola behind the toy truck. Okay, nothing else that's too useful here, some bottle caps, that works. And let's take that blood bag as well. Let's see, was there anything down there? Nope, does not seem to be the case. Okay, that works. Thankfully, I didn't take any damage from there, and also it looked like I saw... Yep, there you go. I saw it. That's a feral ghoul. I'll take the fork. Whatever. Worst case scenario, I could just sell it. Hopefully. There's another feral ghoul here. With some bottle caps and a fuse. And let's proceed forward. My dog's getting up again for some reason. He's a weird one. Mr. Grinch. You really are something. I forgot the songs. I, I used to sing that all the time. As a kid. Oh, hello. All are welcome. Aw, that's so nice. Take that vault deck box. Nuka Cola. Awesome. I also like how it's like a little family. Yeah, little teddy ba baby teddy bear. There's probably like the papa bear. That's a mama bear. And that's like the older brother or something. And then over here you come in. There's a teddy bear, another teddy bear. And it has a bone cutter. Yeah. So, shit just got real essentially. <laughs> That's uh, yeah. You don't want to. You don't want to mess with Teddy Bear there. He he'll he'll go crazy on you. Oh, uh, didn't didn't mean to. Okay, you know what? Fuck off. Okay, nope. I'm trying to go for that headshot. There you go. And headshot. Get that kill. Screw you, dude. I was just enjoying the Teddy Bears, and you come in. You decide to be a douche. You just attack us. When we're just... I like how I'm talking as if it's actually a sentient being. Anyways. What we need to do now is we just need to... There you go. Some Nuka Cola will make that better. Because we'll recover some health. A uh, blood pack. Okay, I'll save the blood pack for later on. Okay, so there is an enemy over there. Ooh, legendary feral ghoul stalker. Okay, where's that guy? Okay, he's right there, so... Nope, that was not it. There you go. There you go. Light him up. One. Two. There you go. And just kill him. Just kill the legendary feral ghoul. Stalker. There you go. Awesome. Exterminator leather left arm. Okay. Don't know what the exterminator leather left arm does. Let's see how it... Uh, exterminator, right? It's on the E. Less... Whoops. Crap. I gotta go back up. Let's see. Less ballistic, more energy resistant. Reduces damage from myrlurks and bugs by 15%. Okay, that'll be useful later on. Not so much here, because these guys... I assume they'll do, like, ballistic damage, essentially, because they... I mean, they're not really doing much else. Cool, we got a, a shot on the Feral Ghoul. There's another shot on the Feral Ghoul. And this should be the last shot. There you go, headshot, I think. Could be wrong about that. Anyways, managed to kill him. He has a silver fork. I'll take that because it's silver. And the fork doesn't weigh much. Okay. There you go. Fuck off. Fuck off. There you go. Oh my god! No, I am not ready for this scenario. Oh, God. Crap. Okay. I'm going to end up using that. Or I could use the pistol. I kind of want to use this. Yeah, I'm going to end up using this. Screw it. Okay, there you go. Nope, there you go. Okay, I'm, I'm so concentrated right now. I'm just trying not to die. 
There are a lot of these guys. Also, let's take that very quickly. That's a glowing one. Holy crap, he has a lot of health. I'm definitely not prepared for this guy. Okay, I'm going to need to toss some grenades to take care of him. Also, let's, let's consume that blood pack. Let's throw that grenade. Okay, let's toss another grenade. No, 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 no. Okay, I need, I need to disable him as fast as possible. Oh, crap. This is not going to end well for me. Oh, shit. Oh, dude. Oh, man, man, man. No, no, no. Okay, please, please, please. Stop running after me. St seriously, stop running after me. Okay. I just took a lot of damage. Crap. Let's let's eat that blood blood blah, blah, blah. Let's eat that steak thing. Thankfully he got crippled. His legs are still attached, but he got crippled. Okay, so that works. Oh man. We got a lot of bottle caps out of that. I should have used now that I think about it, I should have ended up using the stim pack because my arms are crippled right now, so I'm not really in the <laughs> in the best of uh scenarios but i mean if it works it works what my arms are not crippled anymore sure i totally planned that obviously what the hell happened why are my why are my arms not crippled anymore like i'm, I'm genuinely curious how how are they not crippled did something happen that i'm not aware of anyways Let's just take all of this. Ooh, I kind of want to take that Brahmin skull. I'm going to take that Brahmin skull. Screw it. I'm going to take all of this. This is all mine. This is all me. It's all mine. <laughs> if you guys know what that quote's from, you guys are awesome. Legendary. I'm going to assume... Yep, there's some more feral ghouls here. So let's shoot him four times. One. Oh, twice, apparently, because that's going to kill him. That works. Every little bit of XP helps. Let's take that plastic knife. Okay, I didn't actually want a plastic knife, but sure. Oh my god. Okay, I'm going to drop a frag mine there. I'm going to go over to equip the frag grenade. And I'm just going to toss it. I'm just going to toss it over there. And then shoot them. Okay, that was bad. That was bad. That was really bad. Okay, that worked. Kind of. There you go. Quick. There you go. Okay, and let's shoot his body off. Awesome. Thankfully, I was able to take care of all of them before they were able to hit me. Also, I didn't actually take damage from the frag mine that I dropped like an idiot. Like, I honestly didn't plan to use that. Like, I didn't plan the use of it very well. I just kind of threw it, and I was just like, I'm hoping for the best. Hopefully, I don't die. Thankfully, I didn't. Otherwise, I would have just been entirely awkward. Also, let me let me let me grab that. There you go, Radex. There you go. There's nothing in that bathtub, so oh, didn't mean to go do that. So th there's nothing in that bathtub, so we can keep going. Also, where's that frag? There he is. Frag mine. Thirty-eight round. And some five. Uh, some five. Some armor, or I don't know. I don't know what that was. I'm I'm tired. I'm sorry. I know I've been saying that for a while. Anyways, let's take that frag mine. That's a Oh, it's a raider. Yep, it's a raider psycho. Okay, I'm going to back up over here. I'm going to switch over to the righteous authority. And then I'm just going to I'm just going to laser rifle it from uh, from far away. Put him into caution, which works. And then I'm just going to I'm just going to try to like as soon as he pops up, I'm going to go for that that shot. Is he going to pop up? Yeah, I don't think he's going to pop up. He's not that dumb. He's not even there. Oh, I'm dumb. Okay, seriously, where did he go? He was right there. Don't know where he is now. Okay, you know what? I don't got time for this. I'm running there with a freaking pistol and just blast his, blast his head off. Cue ball, 30 round. Those two work. Cotton yarn. Don't really care for that. Let's see. What else can I potentially get from here? Frag mine. That works. Another frag mine. That also works. Pack of cigarettes. That works as well. 
By the way, seriously, where did this where is this guy go? What the fuck was that? Nope, he's right there. That's awkward. Yep, I know Peekaboo, you got behind me, but I'm still gonna kill you first. Ha! Or rather, I'm gonna kill you. It's not a competition of who's first or second, it's just a matter of who kills the other person. That's it. There's no first or second. Metal left arm, let's take that. Short hunting rifle, I'm also gonna take that. Actually, I could take everything on him. Yeah. Let's uh, take those two things. Let's see. I don't. I don't think he has anything else you, that is useful for us, though. Was that? That's a cooler. I already checked that. Let's turn on the light. Let's look around. Newsstand. Nope. And the, I believe this heads to another area. Yep. This head, oh, this heads to the Commonwealth. Okay, that's the other end. This is where I actually came in from. So I fought the raider first, and then I ended by fighting. That's some pretty nice looking power armor there. That, what is that? A T60? T51? I don't know. I'm not familiar with power armor. Um, what was I saying? Right, so I, I basically ended up going out of the entrance that we came in through. Um, and that's when I basically got flanked by like 20,000 raiders. And this was this was later on in the, in the game when I was like uh, probably like level 30 or something. So it was no big deal because that was, the, as I said before, that was a broken file where... I, I was OP as all hell. I had all my stats at level 10. To start with. Okay, this is this is the area that I was talking about. Not that other area. So I, I ended up doing the same thing now. Okay. Whoops. Okay. Where are you going? Dog. I just die, doggy. Okay. Oh, yep. This is... Exactly what I was I was thinking about. Uh, let's equip that hunting rifle. I'm gonna adjust the microphone a bit because I, I just changed my position on the couch. I, I I I'm just leaning forward now. Anyways, let's go for killing this raider scum here. If I can hit him, there you go. That works out. And let's get that shot in. Come on, just pop your head out. All you need to do is pop your head out. There you go. And I just need to hit you once more, and you're done. Okay. You really want to go, kid? You really want to go, kid? Not a kid, but... Raider, there you go. You want to? You really want to fight me, Raider? You going to die, son? Okay, I need to recover some health. Um, let's see. Dirty water? Sure. Irradiated blood. Yeah, let's take the irradiated... No, that was a dumb move. I didn't, I'm not going to recover everything. Whatever. Let's go for that. Headshot. Oh, so good. Oh man, it's so freaking good. Anyway, let's let's actually make some stuff here. Let's make that bloat fly. Let's cook some uh, soft shell meat. Can I make a stew? No, it doesn't seem like it. Maybe soup. Nope. Utility starch. I don't know what. Oh, you use adhesive. Okay, so you can make your own adhesive. That's pretty cool. Whatever. I'm going to end up making a grilled rad stag. Let's see. Some mud chops. Nine mud chops. Holy crap, that's a lot. Ribeye steak. Uh, some roasted myrlurk meat. That's awesome. And that's pretty much it. Either way, that was pretty cool. We got a bunch of XP out of that. Not really. We got we got a little bit of, we got a little bit of XP. I like how I'm, I'm saying that's a bunch of XP. Nope, that was a little bit of XP. It, it was barely anything. No! I want to live. Oh man, I got scared. Every single time I run into, um, into, what's it called, mines, I always get scared when I'm not playing on the, the other file, just because I'm still very low leveled right now, and I'm playing on survival difficulty, so you take more damage than you're used to. Or rather, you don't resist as much damage as you're used to, so you go in, you know, you're like, I'm the best, I'm awesome, and stuff, and then you just die like five seconds later, you're like, what happened? And they're like, you you died. And you're like why and you're just like they're like you you just you just sucked kid and then you start crying i don't i don't start crying i, I was just saying in general i don't, I don't know <laughs> um yeah so we're pretty much done with this area if i remember correctly so uh let's see where we are in the map okay so that goes oh that's pretty cool it goes east and west cool so that that literally just surrounds 
the uh, Diamond City, like the, the east and the west side of Diamond City. Let's go turn in this... Actually, can we turn this in? I don't think we can. Because <laughs> it just said that... I don't think there was a reward. I mean, we, we kind of got our own reward by killing the um, the glowing one. He had like 100 caps on... <sighs> Excuse me. I choked on my own saliva. He had like 100 caps on him, so I, I guess that's the reward that, that they were talking about. Yeah, because it doesn't seem like there's any reward here at all. Sure. W why not? That, that works for me, I guess. Why not? Sure. <laughs> let's go talk to this uh, this robot over here, actually, and let's just sell him everything. Sure. Yep. Uh, okay. Sell you... Let's see what I can sell you. I'm going to sell you... Compensated powerful 10 millimeter or the glow sided. Okay, I'm gonna sell you the glow sided. No offense, but that one's this one is better. The one that I got up there. I'm gonna sell you that. I'm gonna sell you that as well. Uh, I'm gonna sell you the dirty gray suit. I'm also gonna I'm also gonna sell you that. I'm not really gonna use that. So, yeah, I kind of want to end up using that metal left arm though. Let's see, left arm, two and five and seven and three. Okay, that one that one is much better. Okay. That's, S sell you that, sell you that, that, sell you one of those, sell you that. Uh, I don't need the welding goggles. Looks cool and all, but it serves no real purpose at all. Um, there you go, equip the metal left arm. Um, I, I did, did I equip the metal left arm? I mean, I don't see it. Strengthened, hardened, raider left arm. That's four and four. That makes eight total. And this is... Yeah, this is better. Okay, so I, I need to also sell him my strengthened... Actually, you know what? You take the strengthened thing. Strengthened left arm. The strengthened, hardened thing. Okay, so equip that. Give me that one. And then I'm going to sell that one back to Percy. Or not back to... I'm going to sell it to Percy. So, uh, leather left arm, that's what I'm selling right now. Leather left arm. Actually, I'm, I'm also going to sell the, some of the frag mines. I don't really use those that much. Yeah, that works. Anyway, thank you guys very much for watching. Um, actually, you know what? I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to just go over here and just get my house very quickly before I forget. Because I'm gar I can guarantee that I'm going to forget between this episode and the next episode. Because I'm pretty sure it's going to be a while before I record them. Just because I already... I basically, I'm already set until the New Year's, and I'm pretty sure I'm not going to end up making too many, um, like, between, like, Christmas and New Year's, just because that's going to be family time, that's also going to be when I'm going to be hanging out with my friends, so I'm not going to be, you know, focused on making videos, I'm just going to kind of enjoy life in general, uh, I forgot this lady goes to sleep, well then, that was smart of me hello security world. guy got it. yeah he's not even here dude look, look literally look around the mayor's not here at all that's his bedroom but he's oh there he is sorry mayor mcdonough excuse me but i'm very busy right now really you're very busy doing what kellogg's house key that doesn't do anything for us giddy up buttercup you could sell that for a lot of money if i remember correctly uh you know what i'm just gonna wait for i'm just gonna wait for her here yeah. So, let's see. I can wait probably like four hours. Maybe it's a typical nine-to-five job. If you attempt to take something and you're detected, local guards and friends of your victim will attack. Oh, she was here the whole time. Need something, honey? Housing permit? Yep. Um, you know what? Let's look for another job. Mercenary type? Tell me about the permit again. Okay. Housing permit. Let's buy it. Here's the key. Awesome. Hey, Geneva. Visit my home. No, I didn't want to talk to her again. I'm going to go visit my home in uh, Diamond City there. Yeah, yeah, you're, you're welcome for that f coat of green paint. Um, It was the hardest thing that I've ever done in my life. Yeah, let's, let's, go, let's go with that. It wasn't really. <laughs> And, uh, actually, crap, now that I think of it, you know what? It doesn't really make that much of a difference. I was about to say that, uh, it, you know, getting a house here, it counts as discovering a new location. It doesn't really matter, honestly. 
Like, look, you walk over here. Oh, you discovered home plate. Cool, that gets us up to the next level, actually. That was pretty smart. Um, yeah, I think I'm pretty much just burned out at this point. I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna go to sleep. <laughs> let's level up. Let's let's see what perk we can get actually before I before I just knock out entirely. Let's see, bloody mess perk. Um, lady killer. Local leader. I don't really need local leader right now. Party boy, inspirational, uh, wasteland whisper. No chance you'll get addicted to alcohol. Companion does more damage in combat and cannot hurt you. I'm gonna go with inspirational just because that way um, I'm not gonna get hurt by them. And also, holy crap, that's a lot of stuff and junk. And and also. Um, I can't even form my sentences anymore. I'm so freaking tired. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this video as always. Thank you guys for watching. Uh, take care and goodbye, sirs.